it's what we want to do when we come in here uh, against our rival. Uh, you know, we, obviously we want to get the win. We want to keep progressing as a team. I think tonight we did that. And to do that uh, against a strong team like Clemson, and when the emotions are high, and to be able to play through it and get the job done, I'm very proud of these uh, girls. And we had a lot of young players out there, first time playing Clemson, and now they, um, they realize the intensity of these kind of matches. And that's going to prepare us well as we get into SEC play, because that's how it is uh, for the uh, whole uh, conference season. How do you think Alexa did tonight, returning from her injury? Uh, I think she did great. I think it's a very difficult environment to come into. She just got clear. This is her first time really playing fully. Um, and so we were expecting us to get a few minutes out of her. I think she did a great job. Uh, she's obviously worked hard on her fitness as much as she can, uh, not being full go. And she was able to give us great minutes out there. Um, you know, she knows that she can be better, but she uh, expects a lot about herself. Um, but the work rate was there, and uh, every game she's going to start getting a little more comfortable and, and give us better minutes. Um, we limited them to shots. She had a lot of service in our box that she cleaned up and didn't need to save something. So that had a lot to do with how our defense did, but also how she came in and won balls in the air. Uh, they they, they want to serve balls in, um, put things on top of us, the long throw-ins. They, they serve a ball well from anywhere in their, in, uh, their offensive half. So I thought she did a great job to demand her 18 and, and clean everything up. I didn't know for sure what the score was going to be, but I know it's always a really tough and competitive game to the end. So I'm just really happy we got the result we did. Uh, I think we could have taken more chances offensively, but we held it in the back line really well and we didn't allow them to get a goal, which was, you know, the end result. Once you got the one goal, did you feel pretty comfortable that, that they couldn't score? Honestly, no. I thought I kept telling myself, I was like, we're not safe. We got to keep going. Got to find some insurance. And honestly, like the 80th minute, I thought we were tied. I was freaking out, but <laughs> I didn't remind myself that we were up 1 0. Well, Game Cognition definitely showed up tonight. That support was unreal. Um, just seeing the stands fully packed, having everybody around the, the, the Stone Stadium was, was incredible. Um, definitely helped us, gave us a lift. And uh, just the back line, the whole team played great overall defense, and that's definitely what helped us keep the 1 0 lead. I think with three or four minutes left, there was one that almost bounced mm -hmm. all over your head. You get a little yeah. nervous there. Yeah, a little bit. Um, sometimes letting it bounce isn't such a bad thing because it means you can both go up and contest evenly. And um, goalkeepers tend to get a little bit more favor, so I wasn't too worried about it. Um, and my, I know my back line was recovering behind me, so if anything were to happen, I think we would be in a good position position to keep them out. Um, but we kept them out the whole game, so that was the goal.